focus. Hello? Hmm. I'm too short for you to see my sweater. I need to tie this up because it's distracting. So hello friends and welcome back to my channel. In this week's video, we are going over my giant collection of UBC merchandise as an employee at the UBC bookstore. I'm going to go over pricing, wear and tear, regrets, and things that I still wear today and I think are totally worth it. And really how to save the most money and make the most of your dollar. I have a lot of merchandise from the bookstore at UBC. I also work there. So that's another fun fact. One of the things that I absolutely don't regret buying is actually this hoodie. It is actually my favorite hoodie that I wear the most. I actually bought this from my dad. Um, it's an extra, extra large and he almost never wears it. And it's a lot bigger than I am, but it is probably the coziest thing I own, really. My biggest advice is waiting for their red tag sale. So that's when markdown items and reduced price items are given an additional 50% off once a semester. You save super big, but the downside is that some things never go on sale and actually waiting for the sale. I guess one of the things that I love the most about it is that I can study in it and it's great for that. But also, I really, really like the hood. Yeah, so I really like it because it's probably an extra extra large and that's why there's a lot of space. I have a big head and even though I'm an extra small person, you can wear these around the house and I think it's super cozy. I study for exams with these. I'm doing work from home wearing this. So I highly recommend that if you're looking for something cozy, look through our sale section first, especially because it is the cheapest. And like I said, I bought this while it was already on reduced sale, but I waited until the end of the semester and then I got an additional 50% off. Okay, so, so. So while editing, I realized that my camera timed out and did not record some parts. So forgive me for the different lighting, but I re-recorded everything at like 1 a.m. the same day. So this is UBC's premium iconic hoodie. The fact that it's embroidered very nicely, it's very thick and high quality, and it'll keep you warm, makes it so that everybody is basically wearing it. The biggest issue with this hoodie is the price. It's very expensive, but that's because it's meant to last. So my biggest regret is not a purchase. It's the fact that I didn't know that UBC had sales. So word of advice, you don't need that hoodie yet. Wait for a sale. So this design is one of our basic crew necks and hoodies. And the nice thing about our basics is that they never go out of sale or stock. We always have plenty in our warehouse. The issue is that when I first started as a UBC student, we did not have extra small as a size. And I get a lot of customers coming up to me asking me, hey, do you have this in extra small? Do you have this in extra small? Well, we do have the navy basic hoodie in extra small. We unfortunately don't have it in the, in the gray, unfortunately. And our crew necks, especially our basics, because they last the longest, they're embroidered, they're the hoodie that you wear when you want something that you know is not going to wear and tear. Like I've had this hoodie for about four years. I've had this crew neck just as embroidered. I've had it for five years now. So I also do own a print screen, a print screen crew neck. And I was going for a cozy look as well. Um, but this is one of the items that I regret the most just because it is print screen. I can see cracking around the lettering. It's white here, but the red kind of got into it. I don't know if you can tell up close, but you can if you're in person and it's not that cute to me. Also, I feel like because it is 50% polyester, 50% cotton and for the price, it did stretch out. It's not as comfy. I don't wear it that often probably would wait until a sale period to pick one of these up. So I ended up buying the print screen just because it was cheaper overall. My word of advice is don't buy anything unless you're totally in love with it. And if you're considering and debating it, especially for things like our crew necks and our hoodies, just wait until a sale period because we do have sales quite frequently such as the one that's happening right now where everything is cheaper than what I paid for. So just keep in mind when you're making your decision not to rush because we almost always have these in stock no matter what. I will say though that the sale going on right now is equivalent to most of our 20% off nights. So if you were looking for one of these hoodies, I would jump on it now.
At the end of the day, I personally prefer the hoodie. It's an extra couple dollars, but I think it's totally worth it. I feel like this comes down to preference. I'm not the type to really layer anything. I like to put on a hoodie and go or put on a hoodie and a vest. So really, I think it comes down to preference. So if you know me, you know that I love a good quarter zip. I feel like there's not a lot of places that sell them. I'm not a huge fan of like the fully zip hoodies. I feel like if I'm wearing a hoodie, I don't want a zipper in the way. But I do feel like quarter zips are very nice, easy to wear. I will say that most of our quarter zips have an amazing texture. They're not too thick, not too thin, but very smooth. Inside it's kind of fuzzy. Unfortunately, we just don't seem to carry them that often. Because I adore them. I get a lot of people asking if we have any other ones and unfortunately we don't. I forgot to mention that items like these in our hoodies are usually unisex. The nice thing about this quarter zip is these. The cuffs are fitted and they're not loose. Nice and tight. Let me see. So I really like these. I also like the fact that it's heathered. At the time, this was a little pricey. I'll put the price down below. We actually don't currently have this in stock. It's one of our seasonal items. Our seasonal items are things that are just there for that one season. And if they're really popular and there's high demand, then we bring back more. I have no complaints about this quarter zip. I actually bought this for my best friend and I borrowed it back for this video because it's also one of the things that I bought. So yeah. Another discount that we also have is if you sign up for our newsletter. If you sign up for our newsletter on your birthday, you get 20% off on purchases or online orders. And our online orders are amazing, especially during rush season. I don't think a lot of people know about them and I think it's a great opportunity to take advantage of. How it works is if you have a Canadian credit card, then when you sign up to the UBC Bookstore website and then you type in your student number, it'll show you a list of optional and mandatory books or eye clickers or e-textbooks that you can buy or rent. The nice thing about that is one of the rush cashiers or staff members will go around and pile up everything that you need so you don't have to be fighting through the masses last minute worrying about getting everything. The nice thing about that is that you don't have to keep coming back and forth from the bookstore if we don't have your books in stock or we don't have the item that you're looking for in stock. Once it comes in, you automatically get emailed once we've picked up everything and put it together. And you just have to come by with your student card, sign a little piece of paper, and you are good to go for the semester. Much less stressful. There's no lineups. So personally, I'm not a big fan of this cardigan. We sell it and it's a little bit pricier than what you would expect um, but it's very cute and very durable let me just say that like this material like she's this and it's something cute that you can wear to be formal it's got like the ubc colors right here it's got our emblem and this is embroidered and oh, let's try not to hide it this is it was something that is professional and formal that you can wear or you can unbutton it put a hoodie underneath or just a t-shirt and it also looks like you're trying to dress up a little bit more which is kind of hard when you're a student because let's be real 24 7 we're studying i mentioned before that we do have 20 percent off nights once a semester but another way for you guys to get a discount is that we actually do markdowns and i have been the person doing markdowns it's a lot of work so if you ever see something on sale it's ticketed by red tape and it has a sale price and what that means is that that item is on sale. Unfortunately, if you buy it on an impulse, then it is final sale because we don't do exchanges or returns because we're actually pushing out all of our merchandise so that we can bring out the next season stock, which I think is very clever. And I've definitely bought most of my things on sale. Um, I bought board games and everything from it. And I think it's a really great way for students to save money. Now we also have board game night. It also comes with a perk. So one point in time when we were having board game night, we were also giving away free socks. I ended up getting a lot more than you would if you bought a board game that night actually, because when I bought my board games, I was also competing for Socktober. Every once in a while, the bookstore will do events and they're really fun in my opinion. They're a little pricey sometimes depending on what the event is. But for example, if I bought socks, which I did, if I bought a pair of good luck socks, which by the way, I've seen them on Dragon's Den and I think it's amazing that they're a Canadian brand. I bought a pair of socks for myself. I also bought a pair for 
my sister, and my best friend. And eventually I did win. So the university and the bookstore actually hold a lot of contests and giveaways and I highly recommend you give it a try because you can win some free really cool stuff. So among my friend group, two of us ended up winning the sock bundle but not the ultimate prize. One was me and one was a photo that I took. So yeah, I think this is a great way to meet friends but also win big and then save a lot of money by participating in contests and giveaways. Because overall, I think I have like $100 worth of free new socks. So like I mentioned how to save some money, this item was actually a markdown item. I think in my case though, mine was defective because the zipper sometimes gets stuck. But not only that, but this one as well, right here. These two items were marked down and then I waited until the 50% off sale night. And what that meant was that I got the hoodie was retailing, I think, for $50. I got 50% off of that, so your girl only paid $25, which I think is a pretty good deal. So unfortunately, this is one of the items that I regret the most buying. And it's not because of an unfair price. It's not because it's not comfy. It's just that it's too boxy on my body. I am extra small, as you can tell. This is a small hoodie. It fits nicely here. The arms, I love the fact that it says... British Columbia University. I love the fact that there are zippers right here. These zippers get stuck too though. I love that. I love the hood. The hood fits nicely. So I did try this on a couple times, but I guess I was blinded by the fact that it was a beautiful color, the price and the style were perfect. So my advice is go shopping with an objective friend who can help you decide if it's worth it or not because these are final sale. So I'm back, says UBC. This one I love a lot. It's cotton, feels great. The pattern there is pretty cute in my opinion. This is print screened, however. It is a size small and it's still a little big. It fits me kind of like a poncho, but I can't usually wear ponchos. So I really like it. $60, I believe, or $69.99 original price. And then it was $10 off because it was marked down. And then I got 50% off of that. So I think I paid somewhere between 20 and $25, but I bought it specifically for Christmas dinner. Why you may ask? Well, I was planning to eat a lot. I was going to a Christmas dinner party and I needed something that was going to be comfortable. I also didn't want to spend too much money because I was already buying Christmas presents for everybody. Hey, just to let you know, I actually bought my dad's hoodie, this hoodie, during that sale, his was also on sale. Great pricing. I bought his hat on sale. Did I even show you his hat? Did I show you his hat? On sale. I bought a lot of things for Christmas and I didn't expect to, but the sale was just too good to pass up. Sincere ended up buying like a fan. I also got this bottle. I love this bottle so much. You have no idea. I use it all the time. It is BAP free. It holds up to 32 ounces. It's the most beautiful color. I can represent my university. That one wasn't on sale. We did have bottles on sale. I just, I was in love with this one. So wow, this video is a lot longer than I thought it was going to be and I still haven't finished giving all the tips for how to get discounts and get free stuff on campus. But if you're still interested, let me know and I'll put up a part two. And make sure to like and subscribe if you actually like the content. And if not, I'll see you next week. Bye!